Weatherspoon's boss has said the public will shun EU goods if the UK gets a bad deal at the end of the year. Tim Martin highlighted how Brussels has become a laughing stock in most of the world and said the public is fed up with French President Emmanuel Macron and EU chief negotiator Michel Barnier. The Weatherspoon's boss said the EU was pathetic and added if any deal ties the UK to EU laws or fails to protect fishing rights, then the public will shun the EU goods. He said, if the public is tricked or cajoled it will have the power to drive imports from France and Germany down to zero, irrespective of any agreement. In my opinion the public is fed up with repeated warnings from French President Emmanuel Macron and EU Chief Negotiator Michel Barnier, in areas such as fishing rights and prospective delays to deal beyond the end of this year, it's truly pathetic of the EU to imply that a deal can't be done by December 2020. Brussels is a laughing stock in most of the world for its bureaucracy and sclerosis. If Macron and Barnier don't want a deal, or make threats, consumers will simply reject EU goods and will buy from the rest of the world, as Weatherspoons has shown by swapping French brandy and champagne, and German spirits and beers, for UK and New World alternatives. Mr. Martin continued by saying that anything bought from Europe could be bought from. He added, scare stories about planes not flying, blocked poor ports or loss of jobs in the City of London have proved to be cobblers, and consumers won't fall for Macron and Barnier's baloney. Prime Minister Boris Johnson wants a complete post-Brexit free trade agreement signed by Brussels before the end of the transition period. Mr Johnson is refusing to extend the transition period which will finish at the end of 2020. European Union figureheads, including Mr Barnier and President of the European Commission Ursula von der Leyen, have warned that a comprehensive agreement will be impossible to achieve in the short time frame. But Tim Martin warned the UK and EU negotiators that people will not be fooled by a deal that fails to achieve what he said would be a real restoration. Mr Martin has advised Boris Johnson to abandon post-Brexit trade talks with Brussels and recommended that the UK should leave on World Trade Organization WTO terms. J.D. Weatherspoon announced earlier this year that they will be opening new pubs and hotels across the UK in a £200 million investment which will create around 10,000 jobs. The plans involve opening up 15 more pubs in 2020 expanding across the UK and the Republic of Ireland. Most of these investments will be aimed at developing small and medium-sized towns, but will also include bigger towns and cities, Tim Martin said in January, we are looking forward to opening many more new pubs as well as investing in pubs over we are especially pleased that a large proportion of the investment will be in smaller towns and cities which have seen a decline in investment in recent years. The fact that we will be creating approximately 10,000 jobs is great news too. The chain operates 875 pubs and 58 hotels across the UK and the Republic of Ireland, employing 44,000 staff. Weatherspoon is also planning to open several more hotels across the country, adding to its 58 current branches. This news came after the total sales at the pub chain increased by 4.2% in the last quarter, despite a quiet January.